Are you living in your comfort zone a lot? How much time do you step out of your comfort zone? So here's the thing, we all have our comfort zones and you don't have to be always out of your comfort zone. It's just that you need to know that uh, we have our comfort zones and also be aware that uh, there are some situations where you may have to step out a little bit and uh, do that new activity or new behavior or some change and um, go through it, go through the process. Well, you see, like this box, if you're in this box, you can't see anything outside the box. And uh, you can't see anything because you can only see what's in the box, the four walls, and that's all you know. It's the fear of uncertainty, it's the fear of unknown, and that's what it is, actually. But sometimes somebody else can give you a different perspective. They can tell you, see, or things that you cannot see. So it helps sometimes having a fresh pair of eyes or someone else to help you. What is right outside the box but you can't see because you're in the box. Like just like this. It's uncomfortable, you know, being in this box. Uh, and you, because you can't see what's outside so yeah so think of the first time you walked you probably fell a few times and uh, once you get over the process now you're able to walk you can walk anytime it's the same concept whatever that is uh, the first time you may have some trouble difficulty once or twice and after that I think you should be pretty good to go so um, so whatever it is in terms of having more happy life, uh, having some small changes in your life, small changes in your behaviors, or having some better things in your life, uh, step out of your comfort zone, ask for help, and uh, somebody else may be able to see what you don't see or see around things uh, in the box that you are in, so that it can help you and add a lot of, of value to your life. So step outside your comfort zone a little bit and uh, have a better life.